Hello everyone and welcome back to Shanahan Militaria. In today's video we're covering the Klansman 349 or the Klansman PRC 349 to give it its proper title. Um, I've broken into its components so we have the wire whip aerial, we have the headset, we have the radio itself, we have its pouch and we have the batteries and the different types of batteries so we'll talk about them in a while. So the headset itself, um, we'll cover a bit of history when we actually get to the radio. So the headset itself is uh, just your standard strap with velcro for tightening, uh, one over the top of your head and um, and one around your brow on the back of your head. And the earpiece can be worn on the right or the left, it's up to the user to decide. Um, and it's uh, a regular PTT. But instead of a microphone it's actually a throat mic. So this will sit across, say if you picture your Adam's apple in there, it will sit across your throat and it picks up the vibrations on your neck. So that's how the um, the actual mic in this works. So we'll move on to the headset itself. Uh, as you see, the the radio here in front of me, the Klansman. So if I look at the top of it here, this is for your uh, headset. This is your dial to turn it on and turn it off. And then this is for your aerial. So the zero is off, obviously. Um, the W stands for whisper, the L stands for loud. And then the stare just means it's on constant. So when it's on whisper mode, it, it's uh, quiet, uh, um, loud, and obviously constant. There's no actual volume switch on it, so that there are the two volumes, loud and whisper. Um, these are your three dials for your for your to change your hertz. So you have megahertz, uh, kilohertz, and then kilohertz again. Um, I believe there's four hundred channels on this radio. Um, with the, the setup at the moment or the setup as it is so that's the actual radio itself um, it's a VHF uh, FM radio um, so you will need a license actually to operate this here in Ireland and it uh, broadcasts up to about 3 miles is what it is it's a short radio, short span radio um, they were used for uh, intersection or interstick um, communications um, between foot patrols and Land Rovers. Um, it, initially it came into service uh, with the British Army in 1972. You first see them start coming along and it, it literally had a, a very very large span in relation to service um, from 1972, 80s, 90s. Um, there are pictures of reserve soldiers in the Gulf War 1 carrying these. Um, I believe they, they eventually came out of service in 2000. It was when they, when they eventually stopped being used by the British Army. So that's the radio itself. We'll just cover the batteries. So this is a, a rechargeable battery. So you actually need a charging dock to charge these batteries. Um, I don't have one unfortunately, but you can also buy these and these are called the cassette tapes. So what you do is you open this top part This little bit should come out. A second there now. We just undo it from both sides. So the pin comes out at the bottom. You pull out the top piece and you open up this and basically is you can fit 10 AA batteries in here and you see you have minus plus minus plus or plus minus all the way down along. Um, so you put your batteries in, you close it back up and you screw both parts back together again and then you can insert it back into the radio. So. That's it, that's it back together. So and I'll show you then, I'll just show you on this one where it goes into the the actual radio, so you connect your two diodes together, battery goes into the radio and you just screw this in. That's it, that's your battery in your radio. Now this is the harness, um, it's worn across your chest, 
so the, this will be on your shoulder if you get me uh, to the front and it's got a very neat little quick release so you pull this and then you pull it again and then it opens so that's the actual quick release so I'll just slot it into the actual component for you that's it in its pouch we close it up we will connect the headset oh, that's the headset connected and then the uh, aerial, the aerial is its uh, self-explanatory. This is I don't know if you can see it there. There, each item is serial numbered. Um, and this just screws in on top. That's it. There's your radio ready to go. So if you like what we provide here at Shanahan Militaria, please like, please subscribe, and please tune in for the next video. Thank you very much.